What's up Pokemon community, it's Vinny77 here and today I have the Silver Tempest ETB, the Triple Blister and the Check Lane Blister, so 12 packs in total. Um, yeah, hoping today's opening is going to be really good. At the end of the video today, I'm also going to insert the thumbnail for my end of the year video, which will be out on December the 1st. And all I'm going to say about that video is that it's awesome. And yeah, I'm biased by saying that, but just trust me, don't skip anything in that video. Just watch it from start to finish because it's, it's really good. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Let's get into the opening for today. Okay, so I know that the thumbnail showed just the ECB today, but I actually have the triple blister and the single check lane blister as well. So we'll get these open. I don't usually have the best luck on triple blisters, but then again, saying that, I'm pretty sure when I did the Evolving Skies one a little while ago, I may have had the Ultar Alt go lurk out of that. So I guess my luck is mixed. So we've got the routes. The Curlia, the code card, which someone can have. And then the Gallade Ooh. promo, which is a really cool artwork, actually. Oh, and the giant coin as well, which I forgot about, which has got so fetched. Okay, so we'll get into the pack. So yeah, all in all, we've got 12 packs to open in this one which I've been loving Silver Tempest. I think it's an amazing set. And yeah, I can't compliment it much more. Because if I do, I won't stop. So Spinarak, Beldum, Krogunk, Solosis, Relicanth, and the Alolan Vulpix V, which I've already pulled, but it's still good to pull uh, stuff multiple times. So there is a pull from that, so that's good. I guess the pull rate so far is one of one. All right. Just gotta be careful not to bend these and the promo actually as well. Yeah, these are always tough to open, but I always make sure I open stuff slightly before uh, before I actually start to open it on camera. Otherwise, I'm there for ages trying to find the um, some way to start opening it. So hopefully, the code card hasn't been given away there. So you guys can have that. So there's the Toga Tech which is off-center a little bit, but it's not too bad. It's not like I'm going to have it graded. And then there's the giant Pikachu coin. So three packs with this, and I think we'll save the Lugia artwork for last, just because I like Lugia. So <laughs> can't... Um... Oh, yeah, I'm just going to show favorites, because I like Lugia. <laughs> right, so we've got Stunfisk, Beldum, Emolga, Durant, Fennekin, the reverse is Clink and Keldeo non hollow. Silver Tempest. Uh, Silver Tempest, yeah, we know it's that. It's Regilecki. <laughs> so hopefully we can get at least one pull out of these. It's, that's the usual pull rate, I would say, for one of these. At least you'd hope that's the usual pull rate. Now we've got Smeagol, uh, Ferroseed, Fletchling, Snowrunt, Vulpix. Reverse Altaria. Oh, and Lugia V-Star. Wow, I haven't actually pulled this yet, so that's awesome. Nice. I've just got the standard Lugia left to pull then, because the uh, the odds of me pulling the Altar are ridiculously low, let's be honest. And then there's the gold and the rainbow on top of that as well. And then last pack of the Triple Blisters, we've got Dupider, Venonat, Ponyta, Pikachu, Ferroseed, Reverse Relicanth, and Articuno Hollow, which I've already got. So all in all, out of the Checkling Blister and the Triple Blister, I'm not complaining at all. So I will sleeve those in a little bit. And I'll sleeve these later as well. Right, so let's get the ETB open. I'll try not to take too long doing this, just purely because... Well, I want to get to the packs. There's no promo in this, unfortunately. And uh, I've noticed as well that the sleeves are different if you get the Pokemon Center version. So in this version, the sleeves should have a load of Vulpix on them. Whereas the sleeves in the Pokemon Center version have um, Lugia on them, which is cool. But 
equally annoying, especially if you can't get hold of it. Oh, that's cool. All the icicles and stuff. Uh, so let's have a look at the sleeves. Yeah, so they've got a lot of Voltex. Not complaining, I like a lot of Voltex. So then there's all this stuff in the box. There you go, there's your view on that. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. So yeah, these packs seem a little bit different. I don't know if it's just me. Like, you probably won't be able to tell because I just think that they feel different rather than they look different. But if you think they look different too, please let me know. It's got Ndidi, Marini, Mistrevis, Squad Blue, Swirlix. Oh, wow. The Superior V Trainer Gallery, which I haven't pulled yet. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> and a Reuniclus Hollow. Awesome. I haven't pulled that yet. I'm hoping to get the Zero Aura and the Rayquaza as well. But uh, if I don't, I'll probably end up buying them. Because I like the Trainer Galleries. I'm finding this more and more that I really like Trainer Gallery cards. And I know that that's the same for a lot of people, really. So, uh, yeah. So we've got Deep Rider. Ponyta, Venonat, Ralts, Spinder, Serena, the Full Art Regilecki V. Wow, two Full Arts, two packs. Not going to complain at all. <laughs> Would love it to have been the Lugia, but um, wow, we've got six packs left, so you never know really. Like two for two so far. Like even if it is a trainer gallery, it's still a pull after all. Can we beat three for three, or is this the end of the streak? It's so got Murkrow, Beldum, Balthoy, Sunkern, Vampy. The reverse is capturing Aroma and Noivern. So yeah, the streak's over, but I'm not going to complain. I mean, technically two full arts. If you count the trainer galleries as full art, I think it is. I think it's counted as a full art just for the rarity that it holds in the trainer gallery, you know? Uh, Smeargolf. Esper, Dratini, Chincho, Meditite, the Jinx, and Almaldo. So that's another trainer gallery. Yeah, love the trainer gallery. I think I've already got the Jinx. I think. I'm losing track of how many trainer gallery cards I actually have now. Because it's starting to uh, build up quite a bit. It's so got Feebas, if the camera will focus. Yep, Feebas, Noiba, Snowrunt, Sandile. Fennekin, Reverse Swab Blue, and Miss Magius. How many packs have we got left? Three. Okay, we're saving the Lugia. Let's save the Lugia to last. Because we've got three pulls so far. Like, I'd hope for four, a minimum, I guess. Let me see that. I'm pretty sure I spotted something. Pikachu, Ponyta, Venonat, Deep Rider, Spinder, Galalee, and Unknown V Standard, which I don't have, I think I've got the full art. Yeah, I pulled that um, once or twice, I think. Not sure. Yeah, these packs just feel weird. I, uh, like they're not tampered with or anything, clearly, because I'm getting stuff out of them, but they just feel weird to me. So Marini, Ndidi, Baltoy, Sunkern, Clink, Reverse Noibat, and Teeny. Okay, so the last pack here. I'm not going to complain. I think it's been pretty good, actually. I mean, yeah, full part, full four pulls out of eight packs. Not complaining at all. Uh, but can we make it five just for the last pack magic? It's got Stunfisk, Vulpix, Snowrunt, Fletchling, Ferroseed. Vulpix and Archeops Hollow, which I don't actually have, I don't think. So that is a pull. So yeah, we can make it five <laughs> to answer that question. Brilliant, fair play. So that was pretty good. <laughs> um, yeah, thoroughly enjoyed opening that, and I really enjoy opening Silver Tempest as well. All of my openings of it so far have been amazing. Really thoroughly enjoyed it as a set. Hopefully I can open up some more in the new year, but if it's not easy to get, I'll probably just um, buy the cards that I want, really. It just makes it a bit easier. Uh, yeah, so if you stick around after this little clip, uh, the thumbnail will be there. Hopefully, it creates a little bit of hype. And uh, please do like, comment, and subscribe. And hopefully, I'll see you in that video. See you.